Hello, welcome to amainhobbies.com. I'm Gregor McGrath, and today on RC Talk, we're going to give you a brief overview of the new Rave Ballistic FSO from Curtis Youngblood Enterprises. This helicopter was specifically designed to be an electric only machine and not sharing a lot of the same features as the nitro version. So I'm going to pull the canopy off and give you guys a little look under the hood. This machine usually comes stock with a black and yellow canopy. This machine was sent to us with the black and white edition and it came with the limited edition motor. This, this kit can be bought like this but it's going to be very exclusive. One thing about this machine I noticed, the difference from the ENV, is it has a uh, direct servo to swash plate design and uh, makes it real simple, no more other bell cranks or anything, gives you a lot more of a true feel uh, in the cyclic. And uh, another thing is this machine's got a nice uh, battery tray, it's got thumb screws on it so you can slide the battery, you know, slide the battery tray in and out very easily. Um, the head block is very simple shares a lot of the same similarities as the previous ENV. This machine also comes stock with a uh, helical gear design, which I really like. Very quiet, very strong. This machine is also available with torque tube gears that are helical in plastic or steel gear. This machine has a steel gear uh, outfitted on it. Um, the tail boom, nice aluminum boom, very rigid construction. They moved the tail servo out to the tail boom, uh, which was different. They used to incorporate it into the frames. And uh, the tail slider mechanism shares a lot of the similarities as the older ENV as well. This kit uh, will be available uh, all the time. It's not going to be a factory special order. So in case you want it, you're not going to have to wait for it. So uh, please check us out at amainhobbies.com. I think you're really going to enjoy this machine.